If you've never seen a spine endoscope, here it is. In endoscopic spine surgery, because of all the anatomic constraints, we usually do the whole surgery through a single port. That means that the endoscope has to have everything within it to allow us to do its job. So instead of two, three, four poke holes, it's one poke hole, sometimes two. You can imagine the spine endoscope is kind of a big deal. So check this out. The hole in the end right there, that's the working channel. That's where you put all your working instruments. That working instrument comes out that hole right there. There's also the irrigation ports. So one port is for saline going in and one port is for saline coming out. And then there's the light source right here that goes down the fiber optic camera or lens. You can barely see that. That's probably the smallest part of the whole thing. And the image comes through the fiber optic lens to that eyepiece right there. And then we attach to that eyepiece a camera that connects to this awesome endoscopic tower with a massive 4K monitor. Doesn't look like much. The diameter of that shaft is seven millimeters, but it's got a ton of things packed into that tiny little area.